I love having pamperites, and I make sure that I have a pamperite on several occasions during the week I always make sure at least twice a week I get it it's normally on a Wednesday and a Saturday um, my boyfriend always calls me Sheldon I think from the Big Bang Theory I don't watch the Big Bang Theory but he does and um, he says that like having set routines is what Sheldon does so yeah I always make sure I have set routines I make sure I kind of take time out from whatever I'm doing to do this because it just makes me feel so much better and I love a good pamp session so I always start off with running myself a really nice hot bath and then I give myself a little mini facial. So I like to take all my makeup off first of all, tie my hair back and then I will give my face a proper proper cleanse with a muslin cloth and really work my skin so it's totally clean. I've been using this REN um, number one purity cleansing balm to do this. I'll just put this all over my hands and massage it into my face, really massage it in for a while and then remove it with a warm muslin cloth and it just feels very kind of spa like and lovely and then I'll go in with an exfoliator and the exfoliator I've been using lately is this one by Cordily and it's the Cordily deep cleansing exfoliator I really like this it's kind of quite finely milled and I'll just massage it all over my face and get rid of any dead skill skin cells and kind of get my circulation going again and then just before I step in the bath I'll put a face mask on I have been using this face mask recently and this is the Ren Glycolic Radiance Reveal Mask. I've been using this because my skin's just been a little bit dull and this helps to kind of brighten up your complexion and make you look all fresh and lively again. So I really like this and it's quite comforting because it smells lovely. It's got that kind of orangey, sugary smell and it's just very easy to use and really perks your skin up. So I'll apply that and then get in the bath. Some days I will wash my hair um, and kind of put a, a hair mask on and everything and let that sit while I'm in the bath. But I don't like doing that because I don't like washing my hair in the bath. I feel like it just kind of ruins it for me and then I'm getting gunk in the bath and... I don't, I don't like doing that, I prefer washing my hair in the shower, so I'll normally just put it up away out of my face. Then I'll just kind of light a couple of candles, get in the bath, and it'll be really relaxing and lovely. I always make sure I take my nook in there as well and um, watch YouTube videos. So I'll kind of save a couple of videos. Does anyone else do this? I'll look at my subscription box, I'll decide which ones I want to watch first and which ones like, look the most exciting, and then I'll save them for when I have a bath so I can watch them. They tend to be long videos so I don't have to kind of move and like press play again and things like that but I really like watching videos in the bath. So I'll kind of lie in the bath for a little bit and then I'll always make sure that I use a nice grainy exfoliator while I'm in the bath. The one I've been using lately is the Scent Grapes um, Aqua Bliss Bath Scrub and this is a salt scrub, really really lovely. It's very kind of grainy and it really does work your skin like you get rid of all the dead skin cells and I'll just kind of um, use this all over, really concentrate on my dry areas and it's a kind of nice product because it does leave a slight residue which helps to kind of make my skin a little bit more um, moisturised. So I'll put that all over, shave or whatever I'm going to do, that type of thing. I don't really tend to stay in the bath for a long time. I always go in with great intentions of staying in the bath for an hour but I never can. I can usually manage about 20 minutes and then I need to get out because I have the water very very hot which isn't that great for you but I can't have a bath in like lukewarm water. I need it boiling or so I don't feel clean. So I'll kind of lie in the bath and do that for as long as I can. Then once I get out I like to apply a rich rich moisturiser or a body oil. The one I've been using lately is the Cordily Divine Oil. I love this, I love how it smells and I love applying it and I'll spritz it all over and really massage my skin and normally before I've gotten in the bath I've kind of used the body brush so my skin's feeling all tingly and fresh from using a body brush and then using a body scrub and I'll just kind of put it all over and really work it into my skin and it feels amazing and your skin will feel really replenished and lovely. And then I always make sure that I use a foot cream as well because it's nice to kind of give yourself an extra pamper. And I'll use the Lottil um, Seriously Good Foot Care Foot Cream. It's very, very thick so I kind of will apply this all over my feet and then put a pair of socks on so it can kind of really sink in. And then for my face, once I've rinsed my face um, wash off, I will go ahead and, my face mask, sorry, I'll go ahead and apply my brightening toner. I've gone to, I've started using this only twice a week now instead of every day because I felt like it was kind of making my skin a bit red and I've since felt like my skin's been better so I use this twice a week. But this is the Boots All Bright Cleansing Toner. 
I'll swipe this all over my face and then go in and apply a facial oil. I love doing this. And the one that I absolutely love and go back to every time is the Balance Me Radiance Face Oil. I'll just get a couple of drops of this on my hand, warm it up a little bit and massage it all over my skin. And it feels really, really nice and just makes my skin look really glowy and healthy and lovely. And then I will put my pyjamas on because I love wearing pyjamas. <laughs> So I'll put a nice kind of cosy pair of pyjamas on and normally on a Wednesday I will watch um, Devious Maids after I have a bath because that's kind of what's on on a Wednesday and then on a Saturday normally I will watch a film or something like that. So I find it really relaxing and it always makes me sleep better after I've had a nice pampering bath but I thought I'd share with you my kind of winter version of the perfect pampering night and what I like to do. Definitely let me know what your favourite things to do are and whose videos do you watch while you're having a pamper night that would be really interesting. I tend to always go for Miss Budget Beauties. Michaela, I watch you in the bath. Is that creepy? But um, yeah, that's what I like to do. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big, big thumbs up and I will see you in the next one.